Welcome back to my Dungeons & Dragons Animal Character Mashup series. This is the fifth of six little critters that were made using random animal and Dungeons & Dragon character generators. In this video, I am coloring Merrick Toscobble. He is a stout halfling monk zebra. He is very dexterous and is proficient in acrobatics. When I was initially designing this character, I had somewhat a hard time drawing. Well, first off, a zebra first time drawing that, and secondly, a stout halfling who is also an acrobat. I wanted to make this character, like, believably balanced. I propped him up on one leg in a tree yoga pose, and I made sure to pay attention to any possible leaning that the character might have in order to make him really look rooted. And when I was coloring this guy, I think the most fun part was probably coloring his stripes. Um, this is like the one time when I can really use my white colored pencil. Um, that was because the paper I was using was off-white. And so yeah, using this white colored pencil in the black, it just made his fur look super silky, and I really like how that turned out. Um, anyway, let's learn a bit more about Merrick Toscobble and how he adopted the monk lifestyle. He spends the majority of his time in silence, searching deep within himself for enlightenment and the universal truth. He used to serve as a knight for the Quidditch establishment, but was exiled from his community on suspicion of treason. He lived alone for a number of years, practicing various religions, and settled into the lifestyle of a monk. He thinks about every outcome of every situation before acting, and believes that everyone should be judged based on the universal truth. He just hasn't figured out what it is yet. He struggles at times with temptations of the material world, but always returns to his quest for enlightenment. He believes King Danzies must be taken to justice and thinks that his quest might help him find the universal truth. Anyway, yeah, that's about it for Merrick Toss Cobble. We have one more character left before this series is done, and in the next one, that character is probably my favorite out of the bunch, so stay tuned and I'll have that out sometime in the future. Anyway, I just want to thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope you have a great week, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!